What's going on you guys? This is MXKDR, another Dell Optiplex 7070. Small form factor, gonna be upgrading the power supply. So you're gonna move the second of the panel. So you get this little latch where you press it down your finger. And you slide to the left. So what I will do is I'm going to start off from the back. So there are three screws in the back. And you will need a Phillips head and a flathead screwdriver. So this is the power supply I'm going to be upgrading. Uh, this is a 240 watt. Uh, this one in here is actually 200 watt. So basically uh, I'm going to be installing either GTX 1650 here, the low profile, and 200 watts is going to be kind of low. But I'm just going to do 240 watt. This is the one I have as a spare now. And uh, usually they run about 40. I think you can get it for around 40 dollars used online. But the one they have, you can get them on the 300 watt. They run about $80, a little bit too expensive. So what I'll do is, I'm gonna move the front cover basil. You're gonna move the hard drive caddy and the cage. I have to go in the corner and here right here in the corner of the CPU power 4 pin you have to remove and the 6 pin here the power and they do have the clip on you see right the clip Secret clip, you have to press on it before you pull it. Now you're gonna take a flathead screwdriver. Also here in the corner, you have to press on here. And there's another secure clip you have to press on here in the corner on the left side. Right there. Press on this power supply should slide to the left. Come right out. So yeah, they look the same. This is a 200 watt, this is a 240 watt, they're both 80 plus bronze. But looks like the inside is different. The circuit board is not the same inside. So you're going to connect the 6 pin power. And go to the other side. This. 
Connect back the CPU, 4 pin power. I'm going to take a flathead screwdriver. So the clip on here, it's metal to the case, so you have to use a flathead screwdriver to bend it back. What I will do is, I have to connect it back to the optical drive. The SATA and power cable. And I'm connecting the external extra storage for the hard drive. This is a two and a half inch. Now what I will do is I'm going to back side again. Put the front cover basil back on. So guys, we upgraded the power supply. This will be the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.